Okay, there we go. Hello, everybody! Finally, it's time! Glory first wrestling! While not officially starting... We begin the final steps here tonight in these, uh, first of two title tournament super shows. All right. First up here tonight, we've got the men's. Hey, Denzen Hall. Welcome. So, tonight, we have... Eight competitors in a full tournament in the game. It, it's going to be in a King of the Ring tournament. Okay, but obviously it's not for King of the Ring. Uh, it's for whoever wins the title that they represent, that they possibly created, or I assigned to them, which is a thing, uh, because I did get uh, some... Not a lot, but some titles uh, that. If <laughs> if Chris Jericho fucks up any of these matches, I write. And yes, hello Wolf, hello Patrick as well. Uh, I've I've already set up the the thing, and let's just say. I'm personally not happy about uh, how the roles went and who I am up against uh, to possibly fight for the title that I made, uh, which um, you will all see. You all will see all eight titles in their glory for the guys here tonight. Uh, everybody's title that they have is. Essentially, in its uh, purest form, I guess you could say. It has been unaltered by me in any way. Okay? So, consider this a PSA. Alright? So... The title that Anthony Decker has, which is a TV title that I've shown off. That's the title as he made it. I've done nothing to it. The title Jimbo has. He made it unedited by me. The title, uh, all the titles made by Silent Hero, uh, Short Bus Eric, uh, Vincent Stafford or Project Valkyrie. Um, uh, Patrick, your title. Uh, and... Well, obviously my title, I made it, so... Uh, and Silent Hero, and even the title that was given to me that I assigned Fanboy Brian to have, they are all untouched by me, okay? But whoever wins, that title will be in the Glory First Wrestling program at large for the men's singles title. And upon doing that, I will have to edit it slightly, okay? Essentially, I will have to add, you know, like, if they don't have it, I will have to add, like, the GFW logos, you know? Or just, you know, pretty it up a little bit, possibly, you know? It, it, no, no, nothing big, nothing major, nothing out there. I'm not going to completely redo it, because your title, your vision, I will just... Uh, bedazzle it. I don't know. <laughs> uh, so, tonight is the men. Thursday will be the women's. So, we're going to have two title tournament super shows. Which, I'm not going to lie, the, the women's titles, they came down to the wire getting eight of them. But I got eight of them. Whereas with the guys, I've I've had them for a tiny bit, uh, but so
Well, hey, everybody, I just want to say thank you to everybody that sent me not only titles that you will see here tonight, but obviously characters. Okay? I've got plenty of characters. I have over 50 characters right now as it stands. And that is plenty. That is plenty to start the universe. And I already know that I have more coming from people that obviously they're like, they're busy, you know, life, all that type of stuff. You know, other more important things are taking their time than creating wrestlers for my stupid show. <laughs> okay. Um, so while I am not like I did in the past, while I am not pushing to meet the max amount, uh, this year, hopefully more than ever, uh, kind of like in past years, like I want to say going back to like a 17 and a little bit in 18, we're probably going to have more characters. Like I'm not, I'm not talking about like internet celebrities or anything like that, but like characters personas uh, so to speak like they're not based on real people they're ideas of people made by a specific person okay and hopefully that will be good you know so we don't have a roster that is like one fourth uh internet celebrity filler uh, trash mob type wrestlers that are just there for growth talent type deal. Okay? But tonight's not about that. That is what's to come. Tonight, it's about these titles. Okay? Everybody is stacked, okay? And I will say that I've done my testing, so to speak. Uh, I've went through the tournaments a few times, and pretty much every time I've had a different winner. So that's good. That is a good thing. But in doing so, I've tested like how I want certain things, uh, like or options. I guess you could say, uh, to be because there are certain options that you can set uh, for how things flow, I guess, uh, in the match. Uh, so I know what to do there. But how about before we actually begin, we actually get into the match, we get into the show technically, and we just have a little look-see at what exactly my uh, dice that I have brought up for the tournament. Y'all ready to see exactly where possibly your favorite character that you might be rooting for or against landed? Have a little look-see. There it is. There you see up in the top, You oh, we're going to start the night with... Let me go up here. We've got Anthony Decker versus Jimbo Socks. Then after that, we did... We got Fanboy Brian versus the Anarchist Vincent Stafford. Then... In the next little uh, bracket thing, we got Silent Hero versus Short Bus Eric. And then last, but most definitely not least, you have Reset Patrick versus my character, Robe. And then from there, we'll move on to the next and to the final. All right. And now these first round matches and such, they're regular matches, regular one on one full count or submission uh you know hit the one two three whatever it may be that's what you got to get in these first 
uh, round matches. So. <laughs> Well, I mean, short bus is here. Just, just don't ask him why why Little Caesars is now closed because they're here for catering. So, there's that. So let's go into our holding pattern. Come on. There it goes. Come on. Come out there. You got this. There it is. There's the GFW logo. So, yes. Yeah, so, not only are you getting to see characters and all that type of stuff, you're getting a sneak peek of the little uh, bit of things coming up here. Starting in July. Uh, the first show, specifically Knockdown, will be July 5th. So, it's finali I'm finalizing the matchups. Make sure the entrances are on. The arena is, yep, it is set to where I want it. And we can go ahead, get into the action with our first match here on the title tournament, GFW title tournament, Super Show. We have Anthony Decken uh, Decker, the Deconator, taking on Jimbo Socks in the first round. Now we just gotta wait for it to load. And we're good to go. Hello, everybody! Welcome, it is I! I am- oh shit. I forgot to turn off commentary. Of all the things... Of course, it won't let me do it here. God damn it. Quit match. Thank goodness it saves that. Audio volume. Commentary. Bye bye. All right, let's try this again, shall we?
I'll be sure to edit this out for the YouTube edit. <laughs> All right, hello everybody and welcome. We are here live in the Knockdown Arena with the first unofficial setup show for the Glory First Wrestling. And there we have our first contestant coming out. There he is, Anthony the Destroyer Decker. This is a title tournament. And there you see his title that he wants to come in to the GFW, a World Television Championship title. Made, created, crafted by him. And you never know, he might be able to get it in because we've seen all sorts of things happen. But now who's he going to take on in this first round of this tournament? And it looks like this title tournament is awesome because here comes Jimbo. And it looks like he is once again after years. There he is, the superstar himself, Jimbo, with the National Undisputed Television Champion or the NUT title. Uh, oh, well, I guess technically it looks like we've got two television titles battling it out to be on the program. So this should be interesting. And also, I, uh, I do have word that we have made sure that unlike in the past uh there will be no interference in these matches no uh we have upgraded some security to make sure everything is perfectly copacetic it'll be one on one as anthony decker starts us off by taking jimbo socks to the mat Hard in our first matchup here tonight of this tournament is oh Jimbo the squeeze is on Hang on There we go, and already Anthony Decker showing an unbelievable amount of power on display here. So I gotta say, it is good though to be back in the commentary seat. It's been a while, but oh, Jimbo is up. Looks like he might be able to rally here. Oh! Couple of stomps. And now Jimbo all over Decker. And, oh, wait, no. No. Oh, able to throw him off. As we still got a match here. Anthony Decker grabs hold. And again, smashes Jimbo down to the mat. 
And... Oh, Jimbo able to block that. Now quickly going to try and end this with a cover. But only a one count. Jimbo sets him up, kicks him right in the spine, and now going up high. Wait a minute, turning around. Oh, my God, Jimbo. If that didn't knock the wind out of Decker, I don't know what will. But now Jimbo here from behind with the Jimbo Justice Slam into a cover. Could this do it? And no. Only two. And Jimbo not happy about that. As now with that kick out is, oh, firing back. Decker tries to go in, missing that stomp. Jimbo coming in with a big kick. And off the ropes, oh my god, that moonsault off the rope. Jimbo going big because he does not want to go home. Not yet, not in the first round. But Decker up, hit with a chop, and dodging another. Oh, trying to get hyped up, trying to get the crowd behind him, but that gives time for Jimbo to get up and lay into him as once again Jimbo climbing up high. And oh my God, another flip from the top, grabbing the legs for a cover. Three, that does it. Jimbo. We'll be moving on to the next round here in this GFW title tournament. As we take a look at some of the replays here. My word, there's the Jimbo Justice Slam. What a match to start off this tournament here tonight. But we've got plenty, plenty more to come. Jimbo Socks with a big win here. But now the question is, who will he fight next in the next round? We obviously have that coming up next before you even realize it. We'll be back. All right. Go ahead and keep that. Hey, Donut. Awesome. <laughs> okay, entrance on. All right, so that was the first match. How was it? Not bad. For a first match. And congratulations, Jimbo. Nobody interrupted. Looks like uh, the nut title, the NUT title, will be... Uh, continuing its journey into the next round. So, now the question is which which title which person will you be facing? Hmm? Because this is the match that we got next. We've got Fanboy Brian versus Vincent Stafford, the anarchist himself, 
each with a title. Looking to have it be carried on, possibly to the finals. So let's go ahead. Let's get into it, shall we? Let's get this loaded and get this going. All right, welcome back. We've got the next match here in the Knockdown Arena here tonight in this title tournament super show. And coming out now, we have our next person with our next title, and it is Fanboy Brian. That's right, Big Time Brian has his hands on the Hardcore title, the Hardcore Championship. He is fighting for its inclusion in the Glory First Wrestling program for this upcoming season, which should be a biggest season like possibly none we've ever known. And having a title like a hardcore championship and all the stipulations that it entails for its defense should be something to see should it make it in. But who is he going to have to fight to possibly get that in? And, oh, looks like this tournament's got a little bit of anarchy on it. And there you have it, the anarchist Vincent Stafford with his knockdown drag out, completely crazy anarchy title. It too is in and could possibly go in the GFW shows now. If my notes are correct, uh, apparently this Anarchy title, it, it's got a special stipulation as well. Uh, specifically, it is to be defended in Last Man Standing rules. Obviously, Hardcore, Last Man Standing, none of that is here in this title. This is just to get the titles in. So we've got some one-on-one -on -one matches, which is what you're going to see. And, oh, look at this. Fanboy Brian quickly hopping up to the corner. Waiting for Stafford to get up. And, oh, he decides against it. Might have been a smart move going in quickly with the chops. As now, Brian grabbing Stafford, bringing him over to the corner. Chop block. Stafford fighting his way out of that corner. Hoists him up, and uh-oh. Oh, backbreaker. 
Stretching out that spine. And a kick gets caught by Brian. Dragon screw takedown. And oh, both feet right on the midsection. Fanboy Brian climbing up only to the second rope and full body misses. Just barely misses the mark. But he's still in this. He's still ready to go. Shaking off that little mistake. Going again for the double feet to the midsection. Going for a cover. Obviously not good enough. Not yet to take down the Anarchist. And an, oh, elbow to the skull. And now, oh, oh, twisting the foot on the face of Stafford. And off the ropes, and oh, catches him with the DDT. And now, focusing on the arm here. And now, once again, on the second rope, Stafford is up, off, and nobody home! But Fanboy Brian quickly up to recover, not giving Stafford time. And now, there's one! There's two! And there is three amigos! Quickly grabbing the leg for the cover! And a kick out at two. Fanboy Brian can't believe it. He was up. He was ready on top of the situation. But Stafford saying no. And now has him submission there. Center of the ring. And oh my God, Stafford taps. Couldn't handle the pain on the legs. And that, that'll do it. It looks like Fanboy Brian and the Hardcore title will be moving on to the next round to take on Jimbo and the Nut title. But we still got more matches in this first round of the tournament. But a win is a win, and... And now we will be back with more action on this title tournament super show for the men's singles title. All right. 